my sister, we welcome you to City Life Ministries. Uh, my name is Tracy. I come from Blawayo. Uh, I came here on Monday for a prayer line. I was having a problem, but I didn't tell um, our overseer that I'm having a problem. And then the overseer said, uh, let's pray. When the overseer was praying for me, the overseer said, touch your stomach. I touched my stomach and asked, what is happening with your stomach? Are you pregnant? I said, no, I'm not pregnant. I said, man, what is happening? Because your stomach is going big, it's growing. I said, yes, my stomach is growing. Um, um, I have been not going to my menstruation, my periods, since last year. I say, are you preventing? I say, no, I'm not preventing. I say, okay, let's pray. And then the prophet uh, prayed for me. After the prophet prayed for me, he said, I must uh, drink uh, the revelation water for seven days. I bought the revelation water, I went home. When I reached home, I started using the revelation water. The first day, I started vomiting. I was vomiting dirty things, uh, smelling with a smell. I started uh, urinating every, after five minutes, I, I urinate the whole night. The second day, I did the same instruction. Um, the third day in the morning, when I wake up, when I was going to work, when I went to the toilet, I was urinating. When I started to urinate, I say I was urinating the blood. I started my ministration. I was happy. Hallelujah. Amen. So my sister, uh, allow me to ask you just a simple question. Uh, for how long have you been coming to City Life Ministries? Uh, it's a week now. It's a week? Yes. Okay. Uh, did you meet any of the people here or uh, do we have a doctor whom you actually met and induced something so that you can uh, start your uh, periods? No, no, I didn't. I only used the revelation water. Okay, when using the revelation water, was anybody part of the ministry at your place? Uh, my sister, my young sister, that one. Your sister? <laughs> yes. And she's the only person who was there? Yes. So, you mean you were ministering the revelation water on your own? Yes, I used it on my own. <laughs> DYT, do it yourself. Done. So, my sister, you mean for a year you had ceased yes. your menstruation? Yes. So, did you try any other alternative means to try and rectify the problem? Uh, because uh, this is not just a simple problem. Uh, I went to the doctor, he gave me tablets, but they didn't work. They didn't work. I drank the tablets for the woman, nothing was happening. Okay, so the doctor gave you something yes. uh, to try and uh, rectify the problem, but uh, nothing worked. Yes. So despite the doctor, because I, I, I am an African, uh, let's uh, come to a sensible compromise. I am an African. When uh, The first alternative is the doctor, but uh, according to our African beliefs, uh, the final alternative, Kufam. So, I want you to tell me if you ever tried any other ways to do away with that. Because this is not just a, a simple problem. It's a very, very serious, serious problem. Uh, so, uh, in my area in Hartfield, where we are staying, one of my sister's friends said, you ma Go to City Life Ministries. Maybe they're going to help. So I just came to say, ah, maybe it's going to happen because I, I lost the hope. 
Okay, so uh, I heard initially that you mentioned that you, your uh, stomach, or your tummy either, was uh, swelling. Um, so can you tell me how it is now and uh, how you are feeling? Because I'm very much convinced that uh, because uh, you had ceased your menstruation and your tummy swelling, uh, this was a very volatile situation. Yes. Uh, for now, you can see my stomach is not big. The people who are here, <laughs> they can tell you my stomach was big, was like this. But now, you can see my stomach is going down. So, my sister, <laughs> are you married? I'm not married. Guys, can you imagine? You meet a beautiful woman like that one. And then she's going to tell me like she's pregnant. Uh, no, guys, let's be frank and honest to ourselves. And you are walking down the street and you meet her, you're like, oh, sorry, mama, take a seat. <laughs> ah! The devil is a liar. The devil is so crafty and cunning. But Jesus is the only solution that we have. Hallelujah. Okay, my sister, allow me to just uh, divert you a little bit. So how were you feeling, you know, as an unmarried uh, lady you are walking there, you are seeing somebody has got a tummy even smaller than yours, and he's saying, I'm seven months pregnant, and you are there, and there is nothing. How are you feeling? The comfort and the... Uh, you know, uh, uh, even my body, I didn't like my body. Because the stomach was going big, everyone was saying, are you pregnant? Are you pregnant? I said, I will start to have that anger in me. What is happening to me? I can't get married. Um, every man who see me saying I'm pregnant, but I'm searching for a man. <laughs> uh, the devil is a liar. The devil is a liar. No, guys, I'm very much grieved by what the devil has done to my sister there. Uh, guys, just look at her. I, I want you to just take a, a closer look at her and just imagine. Just imagine. If looks would kill my sister, let me tell you this. You are a weapon of mass destruction. But despite that beauty, the devil was holding. I tell you, the devil was holding. Ah, okay, Sissy. You ministered the revelation water. When was it when you ministered the revelation water? I started using it on Monday. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So I, I haven't finished the course. Now it's my sixth day. I have to use it for the s for seven days. But I can feel that ish. now I'm a human. I'm a woman. I can get married. Kwaka <laughs> Amen. 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 Uh, no, no, no. Let's, uh, let's put our hands together for Jesus once again. <laughs> so, my sister, for a year, were you spotting or it had come to a complete standstill? Uh, nothing. Not, I, was, I was just standstill. But ish, you know it's hard. It's hard. Can you imagine? It's a woman is a woman every time papa mnenda uku kana kwa kuma iko kuma days iko you see other ladies you know buying some stuff scented and scented what what so ah so my sister do you know them now <laughs> Uh, this is a miracle. Let's put our hands together for Jesus Christ. <laughs> you know, you, you might think actually it was good for her. You might think it was good, you know. But can you imagine her situation? She's a lady, unmarried above all. She's above all looking for a man. And her tummy is just this big. 
she's not even menstruating. Okay, fine, the boy has come. I want to marry you. And then she's seeing that big stomach. And this other side is negative again. You're pregnant. You're, you're pregnant. You are pregnant. Ask that mother next to you. Those are symptoms of pregnancy. Amen? So my sister, what do you have to tell uh, other people out there who are in that very same situation that you uh, were in before? I want to tell those who are in the same situation that I was having, please start using uh, Revelation water. It will help you as uh, the Lord Jesus Christ helped me in my situation. It's going to help you too. Start using the Revelation water. Grab yours is the portion of the love of Jesus Christ. And she hasn't completed her course, however. Let her complete it in style. A new girlfriend is coming your way. God bless you.